Hello YouTube, this is Shark Record Films, and today I want to show you my 1991 13-inch color Emerson television. Now, before we get into this, um, this I'm not sure how long this video is going to be, but I will test the television, and I'll um, demonstrate everything I can. Um, I did find this um may I'll, I'll save the story for last how about that um no nah, never mind i'll just say it right now so i found this uh i saw an advertisement on craigslist of a 13 inch emerson television with remote no picture and it was like five minutes away and if you guys know been a subscriber for a long time you know that my first t television review was a 1987 13-inch Emerson with a remote. And I still have that TV to this day. It's an awesome TV. Here's uh, some pictures. This, when I saw this, I got excited. I thought, hey, maybe it's the same TV. You know, it has to be, of course. I mean, it's the same brand, same, got a remote and everything. So uh, I went I went out and the guy said, uh, yeah, I'll leave it outside my house or something. I drove out there and I checked it out and this is it. This is what's out there. And it's funny, it looks just like the 1987 one. It's just um, newer. It's just an update, more updated model. Let me see if I can uh, try to get this thing turned around. So you guys can see there's a speaker there, um, you know, the report, just like, just like the 1987 one. All right, so let's go ahead and read that right there. So as you can see here, it's an Emerson model number TC1365. Ooh, getting out of focus there. August 1991. And the one I have is from 1990, uh, 1987. But it's cool. It, it, do, it does really just look cool. Um, go ahead and put that there. From just, let's see. Um, one cool thing to notice is um of course just like the other emerson it's got two holes up there to carry the tv easy portability and there's also this little sw these like switches over there Let's see if, you, if the camera can focus into that tv slash cat v or catv mode so you've got i r c H R C S T D and T V. Now, when I got it, it was set to S T D, and uh, I just right now put it to T V because I don't know what those are and I don't know what impact they'll have. But uh, hopefully we'll. Oh, whoopsie! Hopefully we'll uh, get to the bottom of that and find find out. Whoopsie there. All right, let me get this into the, a little bit too much to the left there. Yeah. All right, so let's uh let's go ahead and. Turn this TV on. I sh should have it all plugged in. Um, hold on. Let me let me turn this off. I forgot to mention to you guys that this TV actually also came with a remote, just like the original. Let me go get that real quick. All right, I'm back. So uh, I've got the remote here in this nice little plastic bag to keep it nice and clean and uh, not dusty. So let me go ahead and pull this out here. So here it is. Does it have remotes? Yes, it does. Radical. Uh, so let us let me go ahead and demonstrate what this remote can do by turning the TV off. Hopefully if that works, does it? Am I just not pressing hard enough like the first time I tried to use it? Right. Does this really work? I think these batteries are muerto. Oh yeah, it does work. I have to press it really hard though. The remote also looks a lot, um, what's called slimmer. 
You got power, you got quick view. Let's see what that does. So you say channel one. So if you click select, you can change all of these, all these settings. Then you got volume. Uh, can I click select? Oh yeah, select does that. You got channel up, down, channel 69. I, I didn't do that as a joke. That's just popped up there. Channel 2. We're going to go ahead and set this to channel 3 since that seems to be my default kind of thing. Um, you got lots of options here. You got volume up, volume down. I'm a bit too close to the TV to be handling it and stuff to be using this. You got mute. There you go. So you got a ton of things. It seems like everything on this remote works, which is a good thing. One more time. Yeah, so the remote works too. Yeah, neat. Um, yeah, so uh, I actually gonna want to go ahead and test this television. So I'll go ahead and turn this on, and we'll go ahead and turn the TV on as well. All right, so here we go. So we are set to channel three on the 1991 Emerson television. Uh, channel 4, channel 225, IF, so channel 3 is where we're going to stay. So let's go through the basic colors here. Can I, can I go through the colors, please? All right. Red, green, blue, black. Pretty cool. Uh, all the colors. Boom. Pretty, nice and pretty. Squares, looking good. Looking good. Looking good, of course, as always. Let me try to go ahead and zoom in just a little bit, just to focus it a bit more. Can I do that? There we go. And of course, nothing. Dots. Dot in the middle, six dots, no dots. This last section just has absolutely nothing. It's just black, 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 B, 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 black, 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 black. Yeah, so uh, this TV seems to be pretty fine in terms of, you know, just that. Let me see if I can go ahead. Where's the volume? Oh, no, that's black and white, and I don't want black and white. I think this TV Pass is in the uh, black and white aspect. Chroma? Oh, there's audio. It was right behind the coax. Just completely normal. Sounds great. Yeah, so I think that... Um, concludes that I'll go ahead and turn the power pattern uh, now I'll just turn this off yeah so that works works pretty great the TV itself works fantastic that's um, awesome so uh, I'll go ahead and um, disconnect everything here so I can bring the TV up and uh, show you guys um, a roundabout look um, a better view of the TV so I'll be right back all right, guys, I'm back, and uh, I've got everything cleared up. TV's uh, all tidied up, nice and clean. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at the actual television set. So, go ahead and show the front. We all know how that looks like. So, right here, you've got the on time. This is the, that seems to be IR. R I F inf infrared light. Yep, that's it. That's for the remote control. Here you got channel up, channel down, volume up, volume down, and um, you've got the power down here, nice and hidden. Um, nothing. You've only got four buttons and the power button. 
Although it from afar it looks kind of complicated, but not at all really simple. Um, just a little bit dusty. Um, wood grain, of course. The front of it is just as black as the back. Same color, probably the same plastic. Um, the wood grain does look nice. For 1991, they were just saying goodbye to the wood grain finish. Here you've got the speaker, and you've got the ear, <laughs> or the aux, or the speaker, or whatever you want to plug into there, some headphones or something. you got the back here to carry the TV, which I use all the time, very useful, very dusty. This is where you put your antenna if you want one. Um, I've got my antenna. When I picked up the TV, it did come with it. Um, right there, go ahead and stick that on just to satisfy you guys. And it came with one of these too. Plug it in since it was 1991 and Cokes were more popular and you just put that on there and then there you go. Really neat. Don't want to keep it the whole time though. So yeah. So that's how the back looks like. If you guys don't know, I'm, I'm kind of tall so this is kind of hard for me to do. So yeah, that's the front of it. Like that. Uh, if you guys didn't notice already, it's a pretty small TV. Um, I, of course, I carry it in one hand, or probably two. It's small TV. Um, I think I'm gonna have to finish the video right now. Um, so I think that's gonna be it for this video. This is my 1991 13-inch Emerson color television. I hope you guys liked. Uh, please comment and subscribe, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.
All right, guys, I'm back, and uh, I've got everything cleared up. TV's uh, all tidied up, nice and clean. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at the actual television set. So, go ahead and show the front. We all know how that looks like. So, right here, you've got the on time. This is the, that seems to be IR. R I F inf infrared light. Yep, that's it. That's for the remote control. Here you got channel up, channel down, volume up, volume down, and um, you got the power down here, nice and hidden. Um, nothing. You've only got four buttons and the power button. Although it f from afar it looks kind of complicated, but not at all really simple. Um, just a little bit dusty. Um. Wood grain, of course. The front of it is just as black as the back. Same color, probably the same plastic. Um, the wood grain does look nice. For 1991, they were just saying goodbye to the wood grain finish. Here you've got the speaker, and you've got the ear, <laughs> or the aux, or the speaker, or whatever you want to plug into there. Some headphones or something. you got the back here to carry the TV, which I use all the time. Very useful, very dusty. This is where you put your antenna if you want one. Um, I've got my antenna. When I picked up the TV, it did come with it. Um, right there, go ahead and stick that on just to satisfy you guys. And it came with one of these too to plug it in since it was 1991 and Cokes were more popular and you just put that on there and then there you go. Really neat. Don't want to keep it the whole time though. So yeah. So that's how the back looks like. If you guys don't know, I'm I'm kind of tall, so this is kind of hard for me to do. So, yeah, that's the front of it. Like that. Uh, if you guys didn't notice already, it's a pretty small TV. Um, I, of course, I carry it in one hand, or probably two. It's small TV. Um... I think I'm going to have to finish the video right now. Um, so I think that's going to be it for this video. This is my 1991 13-inch Emerson color television. I hope you guys liked. Uh, please comment and subscribe. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.